Hey everyone, it's Sam Maneri, and we've got another Color Along today. Color Along Volume 19 Variety Coloring Book. We're moving along with this book. We're having so much fun with this. This, today's topic, I don't know who's calling me. It's probably my friend Rachel from Card Services. Uh, just a blue pen. Turn off the phone. Just a blue pen. Now, what kind of pen? You can use any kind of pen you would like it all and I am actually going to use this Bic intensity marker as a pen I'm gonna do a little bit of a zoom so we can get a little bit closer and we've got this page here just a blue pen and I am going to just talk about what we can do with this page in a monochromatic technique one pen i'm not even going to i mean sometimes we use monochromatic and we say i am going to use all the shades of blue or all the same shades of pink or all the shades of orange right but in this one we're only going to use one so what's cool about this i'm going to start with this one is that we've got this excuse me i have the hiccups we've got this page here that is from my book called doggy mosaic part of my mosaic series and in this book we there's a lot of these spaces to color like this that are bigger lines bigger spaces to color less intricate pages to color um and it's a great book to use a variety of mediums on practice different techniques some people swatch some people swatch their colors using these books um so what's different about this is this is a great example of being able to take your coloring book and so you're in you've got your coloring book in your bag in your your travel bag your purse whatever it's in and or you have it stuffed in a I don't know you're it's in the car and there you are waiting for I don't know to have your car inspected or something and rather than having to sit there and do absolutely nothing or listen to the person on the phone that's next to you um, always annoying to me you can just take out one pen so you don't have to like trudge through uh, and carry everything with you so you can still just color with one pen so whether it's a ballpoint pen or you could use a pencil or you could use a marker um, and for this page I am going to work on these little sections of the mosaics these shapes adding different patterns to them because I think that it'll be fun now this one of course I have stripes no surprise right and I'm going to do some contrasting, of course. So let's start adding some circles. So for this one, I'm just gonna add some of these dots or circles, some round roundness to it. Um, color, I'm gonna color this little section in that I've made, again, with just this blue pen. Now, I do have something behind this piece of this page because I don't want the, uh, I don't want it to bleed through. So that's, that's why I have, I always have something behind the page, you know? I've thought about making coloring, uh, creating coloring books that had that page, but I don't because it would increase the price. So I just think it's easier for someone to just kind of take the page. There is an extra page at the end of each book, or maybe a couple of extra pages, and you could easily just kind of pop those pages. Pop those pages out, you know? I'm gonna leave some of them empty. Leave that one empty. I'll leave this one empty too, since it's close. Some on the edge, some not. That kind of looks like a football, doesn't it? Let's put another one over here that is not empty. And this one right here. Not empty. There we go. We'll do another one here, not empty. So what do you think? Have you ever colored with just one pen? I mean, you, you can really just kind of like go to town. You could use a pink pen. 
blue pen, ballpoint pen. You know, it doesn't really make a difference what type you can use. All right, now let's also use, um, make some that just have some specs. Because remember, this is a coloring page or this is a technique that we want to focus on. Why would we use this technique? We would use this technique if we were waiting in line. Well, not really waiting in line. I don't know about you. You're waiting in line and you just break out your table that you're carrying around, pop it over onto the, you know, open it up in line, tell everyone to clear off and to, you know, get out of the way, and you just start coloring. <laughs> Invite your friends over into the line at Walmart. Why not? No. This is when you're waiting in line, waiting for, like, something happening, an appointment at a doctor. Or maybe you are just kind of like, I don't know, you wanted to go for, uh, go sit in a park. You didn't want to bring all your stuff with you. Maybe it's nice outside, it's not so hot, and you said, you know, I think I'm just going to go sit, sit outside, get some fresh air, spend some time, maybe go on a picnic type thing. Um, you are definitely not breaking out the card table in the middle of the line at, boy, that would be funny, wouldn't it? Imagine if somebody did that. Although, let's talk about it. People of Walmart, we don't know, they might do it. That would be, would be a riot, though. Could be, that seems like a Mr. Bean thing to do, doesn't it? All right, let's see what we can do with this one. I am going to do kind of a, uh, a checkerboard type thing. Let's see. So there we go. Okay, I'll do this one also. And this one. So I've just got that kind of grid. Reminds me of, I guess it's the picnic that's happened into my head, right? I'm thinking picnic, and I'm thinking, wow, we could go on a picnic. Um, let's pop this one over here. Again here. We don't know who's ringing my doorbell. We're not going to answer it cannot imagine. Do you answer the door when someone rings the doorbell? I don't. I'm not expecting anyone. All right, let's do another one. How about a zigzag type thing like this? Squiggliness. Usually Scarlet tells me she says, we have a visitor. How about like this? Uh, and then this one. Of course, this one, I'm going to go back to this stripe thing right here. And then let's do a zigzag here, zigzag here. Um, I'll do this one again because I'm trying not to have them touch. Keeping ourselves socially distant in this coloring page. Um, this one right here. I guess I'm going to go with one that's got some circles, but it is... Uh, filled in solid and then this one right here um, mm, 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 mm. so it filled in solid again right it's probably the person that just rang my doorbell that's calling me I don't know who that is does this happen to you Ninety percent of the people that call me, I don't know them. You know? Let's put some dots over here. Okay. Now we've got the dog. Hey, he needs spots too, right? So let's give him a spot here. And then he can have a little spot here. 
he can have a spot here or kind of like a zigzag thing going on he can have kind of a, like another one going on here spot here maybe some spots there something there on his on his toe put some little paw marks some little nail marks there and then I'll give him like another little like shape there and then as far as the bottom I'm not gonna do anything to him there he is he is ready to rock and roll this guy now the bottom I'm just gonna kind of go like this on an angle look how it's making it look like it's more of a sidewalk And I mean, let's think about the purpose of this technique. Let's make, let's remind ourselves a good way to say, hey, here I am waiting for my tires to be changed, waiting for my car to be inspected, waiting for my doctor's appointment. I've got this coloring book with me. I wish I could color. Oh, wait, let me dig this out of the bottom of my bag next to that butterscotch candy that's stuck to it. Wipe it off a little bit and I can color with one pen. Whether it's a blue pen, a red pen, a pencil, a ballpoint, uh, a marker, felt tip, no matter what it is, you should be able to uh, use your creativity and get involved in some sort of creativity. So again, thanks for joining me for this color along color tutorial. I hope you're enjoying these color alongs and uh, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give this like video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that bell, bing bing, so that you get notified every time I post a new video. Monday and Thursdays, 10 a.m., new videos post for this color along book and I will see everyone soon. Hey, have a great day, everyone. Thank you.